a WPTZ News Channel 5 update. Escape from Denimora. The search for Richard Matt and David Sweat. Dave Schneider with you at the noon hour now. This is day 18 in the search for Richard Matt and David Sweat. Armed patrols fanned out this morning. Checkpoints remain in place around Owls Head, New York. Uh, Governor Andrew Cuomo confirmed today that authorities do, in fact, have DNA evidence linking the escaped convicts to the area where police are focusing their search. Now, WPTC's Vanessa Mishania is live in Owls Head with the latest out there. Vanessa, what is going on? Good afternoon, David. Well, I don't know if you could just see behind me, but a whole caravan of Vermont State Police tactical team actually just passed by. So it really gives you an idea of the heavy police presence here in Owl's Head. And what led them here is conclusive evidence, DNA evidence, linking the two inmates to their presence in a vacation cabin not too long ago. Now, over the weekend, it was reported that a man called 911 after he saw the two inmates in his vacation cabin. They went off into the woods. He called 911, realized he was burglarized, and from that scene, evidence was gathered and DNA was linked to one of the inmates. And that sparked this whole search here in the area of Owl's Head, as well as Mountain, Lake, Mountain View Lake and Duane, New York. Over a thousand law enforcement agents currently searching the dense, thick, swampy woods in this area. And police are also urging that you know this is a community of vacation homes, vacation cabins. If you do own a cabin in this area, police are urging you to search it, check on it, see if anything is awry, anything out of place. Also, if you have trail cameras, check the footage on that. They say that no lead is too small in this investigation. And now I'll bring it to my colleague, Rachel Cart, who has been keeping tabs on the search effort. Today, Rachel, what have you been seeing? Well, driving around has been increasingly difficult all morning. And, you know, beyond this one stretch of, of road here, they're, police are keeping media pretty much away from most of the activity. Now, besides a steady flow of law enforcement activity coming in and out of this area, and even along the roads outside of this area, it's been pretty quiet. No helicopters, no real sense of urgency. Police say they are aggressively searching the Owl's Head and Mountain View areas. And but with it being raining pretty hard, Hard on and off all morning. Police told us that they are ready to use new technology to flush out the prisoners if they have, in fact, remained in this area. Now, they are also talking about bringing in all terrain vehicles to navigate the swampy and wooded areas that they're searching. But while this has been an increase of um, roadblocks within the area and it's been pretty steady throughout the morning, there's really no real sense of urgency with them driving around the t town. Dave? And WPTC's Rachel Cars and Vanessa Mashanya live in the midst of the search efforts. They're going to stay out there and continue to follow this story. Now, as authorities are investigating more than 2,000 leads so far, they are still asking if you see anything suspicious, say something. It could make all the difference. Leave an anonymous tip at 1 800 GIVE TIP. That's 1 800 448 3847. Again, 448 38 47. You can also send an email with information that you might have to crime tip at troopers.ny.gov. Our 